Yeah. All right. All right. Okay. Yeah, are you ready? Am I right? How, how, how do I look? You look great. You sure you got the ring? The ring. Come in here. Yes. Hi. How are you? beloved, we have come together in the presence of God to witness and bless the joining together of this man and this woman in holy matrimony. The bond and covenant of marriage was established by God in creation, and our Lord Jesus Christ adorned this manner of life by his presence and first miracle at a wedding in Cana of Galilee. It signifies to us the mystery of the union between Christ and his church, and Holy Scripture commends it to be honored among all people. The union of husband and wife in heart, body, and mind is intended by God for their mutual joy, for the help and comfort given one another in prosperity and adversity, and, when it is God's will, for the procreation of children and their nurture in the knowledge and love of the Lord. Therefore, marriage is not to be entered into unadvisedly or lightly, but reverently, deliberately, and in accordance with the purposes for which it was instituted by God. Into this holy union, Thaddeus and Dixie now come to be joined. If any of you can show just cause why they may not lawfully be married, speak now or else forever hold your peace. Dixie, will you have this man to be your husband, to live together in the covenant of marriage? Will you love him? comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, be faithful to him for as long as you both shall live. I will. Thaddeus, will you have this woman to be your wife? To live together in the covenant of marriage? Will you love her, 
comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, be faithful to her for as long as you both shall live? I will. Who presents this woman and man to be married to each other? We do. We do. In the name of God, I, Thaddeus, take you, Dixie. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. For better. For better, for worse. Through good times and bad times, come rain or come shine. For richer. For richer, for poor. Until we are parted by death. Until we are parted by death. In the name of God. In the name of God, I, Dixie, take thee, Thaddeus. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. To for better. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. I should know this by now. <laughs> in sickness and in health. Until? Until death do us part. Genuine and certified. <laughs> Barring that, I think I'll just hang on. <laughs> Bless, O oh Lord, these rings as a sign of the vows which this man and this woman have bound themselves to each other. I. I, Thaddeus, give you, Dixie, this ring as a symbol as a symbol of my vow. And with all that I have and all that I am. And with all that I have and all that I am, I honor you in the name of God. I, Dixie, give you this ring as a symbol of my vow. And with all that I have. And with all that I have. And with all that I am, I honor you in the name of God. Now that Thaddeus and Dixie have given themselves to each other by solemn vows, the joining of hands, and the giving and receiving of a ring, I pronounce that they are husband and wife. <laughs> Go 
which in God has joined together, let no man put asunder.